So I don't think people realize how powerful mediumship readings actually can be, the healing impact that they can have, the transformational impact that they can have on someone's life. And fortunately, but unfortunately, there's so many mediums all over the place. Everybody works differently. So I'm going to speak from my experience. I started doing readings when I was 20. I am 45 years old now. I've talked about the mentors that I've trained with. I've talked about going to the Arthur Finley College. And I'm always training, always taking courses, always refining my gift so I can expand my understanding of the modality of mediumship. Mediumship addresses the needs of the soul of the individual. Yes, it deals with grief, it deals with loss, but it's also addressing that underlying need of the soul, whatever that might be. And the science and the genius of mediumship actually is found in the evidence in the things that come forward by the medium. If it's a skilled medium that's really trained and honed their craft. I'm gonna give you an example. Sometimes in mediumship readings, Memories may come forward that take you back to a certain time and place in your life where there's a shared memory between you and your mother, you and your father, you and your best friend, you and your grandparent. And what I've learned is when that memory comes forward and you hear that and it takes you back to that place, it's actually reactivating some internal alignment, some internal emotion, some frequency that you may have lost along the way. Some energy, some emotion that you haven't felt in a really long time. And it might be that that's what you need right now in your life in order to let things go, to heal and to move forward. But not only that, in my mediumship readings, when I'm bringing through evidence, you know, and evidence can be personality traits, it can be things that they like to eat, um, how they lived, how they dressed, personal items, things that they have been aware of since they, they're passing, things that you can validate that qualify who they are. So you know exactly who it is that's coming forward, but you also know that they're still very much involved in your life. See, the medium doesn't pick the evidence. The soul that's stepping forward chooses the evidence. It comes from spirit. Remember, we're working with an intelligent energy. So the information that comes forward isn't just to validate that it's them. There's some healing component to that information. And when you can open yourself up to that and understand that, then the mediumship reading completely takes on a different meaning because then it becomes about the soul and the transformation and really living your life to the fullest. And in a mediumship reading, oftentimes the evidence that comes through and the memories will help you to realize things that perhaps you haven't been thinking about. It'll help you to heal things that perhaps you didn't realize you were holding on to. And it might just be remembering something from your past that brought you a lot of joy and a lot of love that can help free you from something that is holding you back now. But the thing you want to remember is it's about addressing the needs of your soul. A lot of people get mediumship readings and they go into it from an ego space, meaning I'm getting a mediumship reading. I'm only going to believe this is real if I hear X, Y, Z, and then you cut yourself off from the blessing. It's not about what you want to hear. It's about what you need to hear. And your loved ones want you to know that they're very much alive, that their personality has survived death, that they're very much involved in your life. So they're going to bring through information that supports that and more. But you have to get out of your own way. You have to be open, but understanding that it's always going to be what you need. And when you work with a medium who is skilled and brings in this understanding, the reading not only helps with your grief, your loss, but it also helps to meet the needs of your soul and gives you exactly what you need. So then you through your own soul power and soul awareness can move forward and create the life that you want rather than 
being dependent on the medium to tell you something about your future. Because you'll realize in that reading that you can create your future now and that you can begin to live your best life now. And you can have your heaven now.